Okay, here we go. Our game up run off the line now. Car number seven. <laughs> Welcome back everyone. Today is June 9th, 2024 at El Mirage Lake Bed in California. Today, Team Ardema Brown is running the Streamliner with their homemade 369 cubic inch 12 cylinder masterpiece. The driver Scott Getz is driving the beast, which has an estimated 1200 horsepower as configured with this 300 shot of nitrous oxide. Once again, it's going to be a happy oh, camp here through the traps yeah. at 267. Ah! Yeah! 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 Peter! Yeah! Peter! That is still a record. Take it. There were tears in my eyes. What was your thought on that? Did you like your fight? You're the man, Scotty. You're the man. Come on over here. 267, baby. Yeah, baby. Woo! That's it. Oh, you're a man. Yeah, Congratulations. Right. Way to go, Scotty. Come on. Yeah, baby. How was that adrenaline rush? That's a good pass. Okay, that's uh, feel? great. I mean, it. little bit. Man, I'm shaking. First, I'm not even drunk. A little today, bit. But... No, up there in fourth gear. A little bit. You know, you, you push that button. Oh, you can feel it? <laughs> and all of a sudden, you're like, whoa, the Wiley e. Coyote spring kicked in. <laughs> so, did you pull out in second? Or you just first? First, just went easy on it, huh? Yeah. Wow, that was a nice I launch. I left the truck pretty good, though, that didn't I? That was an excellent yeah. launch. Yeah. Freaking... That's why we do it, baby. Oh, Martina. <laughs> That's why we do it. This is why we do it. Congratulations, Pete. Yeah. <laughs> <Thank you. laughs> Screw those Model A's, huh? No, I love them things, man. Yeah, right. That car sounded so sweet on this end. Yeah. Oh, 67. Man. It was a screamer. <laughs> and how wow. What was the sound, Greg? Could you it was the sound. I heard. So. Yeah, this, these are our, our sponsors here. We have Snyder Cams and GoPro. And then we just got Maxima Racing Oil. So, and, and then we have Speedway. Awesome. They helped us out a lot. Thank you very much, Speedway Motors, for sure. They're the best. They're really good to us. Absolutely. And Snyder goes back, way back. 50 years ago, we went... Every in high school, we went over and see his shop. <laughs> okay. He's a good guy. Smart guy. Absolutely. And a Zeus tool. I think the Zeus tools went in with... Awesome job today, Thanks to Alan Crawford. Rest in peace, Alan. Yeah. Now we've had a lot of help okay. from yeah. everybody. I know bring up the Congratulations, Scott Getz, for another record for our team, Ardema Brown. Now I want to give a huge shout out to John Wiley for this next video segment. Turn up the volume so you can experience this. This is truly amazing. Thank you, John Wiley, for everything you do. Okay, here we go. Ardema Brown off the line now. Car number seven. Nice and clean off the push truck, grabbing for gears, favoring the left side of the course, looking for speed, looking for that class record of 270. Killed it.
trap at 267.038, 267.038. Beating the 258 class record. Not quite the 270 he was looking for, but that is still a record. Take up to impound, guys. Congratulations. I know Pete's happy right now. What did you take after the run? Well, it was great. It was, it was super. We got <laughs> more effort. speed than we expected. Yeah. Yeah, and we could have even gone past had we geared it right. Um, well, you think it was geared out? We were geared to go 262 at 9,600, and it turned 10,000. So, <laughs> so Scott did a wheel slipping. Seven. Yeah, and we were a little too low gear. Yeah. We yeah. never expected to go. Well, we were hoping. Like I say, well, I was more expecting two sixty two. So that's and a, so the gears between because he ran more RPM. Yeah, it went five miles an hour faster. And that's the fastest you've ever run it at all, Mirage. Yes, in yeah. this car. It only went two seventy eight at Bonneville. Yeah. Um, with five mile run. So you did that in a mile and a third. Yeah, we could have done this at the bottom of this we're going over three, I'm sure. Wow, that's crazy. So you ran uh you ran it on fuel, three hundred shot of nitrous, right. right? Yeah. And you guys were estimating I know you did a dyno run last week, but it cut out at eighty eight hundred, but you were kind of projecting this thing would be eleven fifty, twelve hundred horsepower maybe. I think so far. it'd be pushing twelve, yeah. Yeah. So if you could get it like on a hub dyno, it'd probably be interesting to see that. And what were there any mechanical issues or that you were concerned about or well like I say I, I just was concerned with one of the cylinders falling off a little bit but it, everything looks good it has good compression so all right and uh, the spark plug looked good didn't look like it hurt anything okay so the goal then is the next in in july is cal's going to drive it again and try and bump the existing record yeah, and we'll right. leave the same gears in it that we just ran so it's going to be essentially set up exactly the same. I see you've removed the nitrous. Yeah. Right. So it's going to just run it naturally aspirated. He went 244.5, right, last month? Uh, yeah. So you're just going to try and bump that record. It does have a little higher gear ratio in it from a month ago. Okay. It's got the nitrous gears in it, which are a taller gear. So you're just going to kind of let it see what it can pull. Yeah, huh? The yeah, coils that's... seem to help quite a bit. Okay. Well, he went from 140 he... miles an hour to 244. Yeah. yeah. All in high gear. So it, it's got the ponies to pull it, I believe. Yeah. So. All right. Well, that was definitely exciting to see it. it sounded good. So looking uh, looking forward to July. Yeah, so. there's only one naturally aspirated car at El Mirage mm -hmm. that's faster. What size displacement engine is that? He's a uh, 430 and he okay. burns nitro. Don Ferguson. Okay. Real nice car, much better car than this is, as far as the streamlining. But he's so, running on nitromethane. He's running a fuel class. He runs nitromethane. And We're in fuel also. Okay. We're equal. He's one class. He's 60 inches bigger than us. Okay. Um, Do you remember what right, his... Right on his tail. What's his speed? 270. 270. Oh, yeah. So we're, we're right there. So again, for the folks to understand, because every time we do a video on the, on YouTube, they'll say, oh, a Bugatti went faster, or a Porsche went faster, or this, and this Indy car goes faster, but it has to be apples to apples, right? Yeah, yeah you're so. in a mile and a third, and you're accelerating from zero. On dirt. On dirt. <laughs> Pizza cutter tires. This is this is <laughs> one half Indy engine bigger than they ran in 90. Okay. There's a, there's a 12, they ran H. And they were running about two, 32, I think. Mm -hmm. Weindyke had the fastest speed with one of these engines. And what, do you remember what speed that was? Or? 232. 232. I think that's the fastest. They, no, they were they ran faster this year for qualifying. They went 234. This was this 30 year. years ago, though. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, they're running, so they're running 234 in Indy. Yeah. 30 years ago, naturally okay. aspirated with a four liter. Okay. We got a six liter yeah. and you're running, running 270, 260, 270 almost. Or well, they would have gone 278 at Bonneville. 280, the way yeah. it was yesterday, had we had more, more distance. Yeah, it's insane. So, well, well we got 50 percent more power than they do too. Yeah, awesome. Really cool. Well, thanks, guys. This is oh, gonna be thank fun. Thank you, Greg. All right.